welcome back, McTel Live brothers. This is the uh, the first video for today. I was going to uh, sort of do something different than what I was gonna than what I'm gonna do now. But since I really want to get to Death Stranding by the seventh, I gotta kind of fit a lot of things into uh, just a couple videos. So. First an update, but before that, go over into the search bar right now and t type in Eman67, subscribe to his channel. He's been getting, um, he's been getting, uh, uh, pooned by YouTube's algorithm or their, their, um, notification system has just been screwing him over, so go over and give that dude a like, subscribe, and, uh, up his, uh, viewers, uh, real quick, just real quick, um, and then, uh, to my to my channel new to my channel newcomers thanks for taking the time to watch this video uh, and watch uh, my other videos I'm gonna start uh, after a while I'm gonna start removing some of the view or some of the videos from my channel uh, if they do not have likes most likely uh, within the next uh, month I probably will just uh, mark or switch them to unlisted. Um, so yeah, go ahead. I mean if you have the time uh, Take a look at some of my other content on my channel. I feel like I have a lot of good stuff in uh, to, But you, you need to sort of like sift through it and that's why I want to try to Do some of the work on my own so that I can make the channel look a little bit more organized uh, So but, so then the, the topic of this video is gonna be um, uh, Don't latch uh, because <laughs> just just in making this video, I realized you know my my life has significantly improved since going Ming Tao, uh, but I I do get f I do still experience like a little bit of forgetfulness from time to time, and that's because I'm not really <laughs> uh, I mean I'm invested in improving myself, but the stuff that I forget is more often like the things that other people expect me to do, and that does give run me into some trouble and I am working to fix that to be a little bit more organized but the point of don't latch is that uh, we're just we're just trying to trying to mature in kind of like a, a teenage wasteland and it's it's frustrating because MGTOW would have been easier to learn as a boy or girl but it, 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 it's even harder to learn as a teenager and it's impossible to learn as a young adult it's impossible to grasp as a young adult um, and the reason for that is well when you're a boy or girl you know we watch or we, maybe if we watch if your parents let you watch TV there was you know Blue's Clues or Dora the Explorer or um, or Oswald or something like that and th those shows were cool because you know you could uh, spot the spot the difference or you you could interact with with the cartoon and you could you could see how things added up to the to the eventual conclusion just as a little kid you didn't need any other faculty other than what was in your head already in order to sort of like imagine that and so I think philosophy was a lot easier for, for, for kids to learn. I think there's recent studies that actually prove that. But then as we get older, we get into high school and all of the influences that come with that. You know, you're around more kids more often with parents that teach things differently. And so there's just a bunch of, just a bunch of ideas going back and forth. So then, so then you have, you know, see, junior, senior year, or whenever, whenever you start to go through that next stage in your life where you are, where you are curious about what being an adult really is. And, uh, I don't know, look at sort of like, look at sort of like young adult literature. Uh, you have like Twilight, oh God. Or like the TV show Teen Wolf. Oh my gosh. Like vampire love stories, werewolf love stories, zombie love stories. I think there's one that's a zombie love story. It's called like Warm Bodies or something. 
but the the point of that is is it's that it's it's just it's hard to get through to somebody who is really just hormonal and in their emotions and as you as you get older you gain to you, you tend to gain less control or lose lose more control over your emotions because your hormones are just raging you know and it takes it takes a lot in order to sort of contain you and that's why I feel like that's why there is some such an agenda on containing like ma masculinity because uh, it's it's hard to do when when people are at a, at a certain age because there's there's just no way that you can communicate the philosophy of uh, and, and but and so sort of like by philosophy and MGTOW I kind of met on a metaphysical level math and philosophy are similar but in in this reality that we live it's it's sort of there's sort of like a um, it's sort of like a dichotomy because because yeah if you look at if you look at the way that that young adults are are raised and what we're raised on sort of like the the, the content that we feed on it's very much like the dichotomy of, of of the home and the hearth versus adventure and glory you know the um the the things that pull on you to to be comfortable and the things that are pleasurable outweigh the things that are are tough are troublesome are 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 going to to help you learn and this is what i think this is what i think drives a lot of people off their purpose is is struggling with this dichotomy of of adventure and glory versus the home and the hearth um and so you if you really know that that this is that this sort of life of of comfort and pleasure is not for you then you then you need to detach from any sort of emotional weight that is holding you back from from discovering your true potential however you go about doing that is sort of what MGTOW Live is about because there's a I mean there's there's multiple ways to skin a cat and I, and I think that MGTOW across the US and uh, the world are going to develop different philosophies but kind of like math you know it's all it's supposed to it's supposed to represent a universality of perspectives um so that's going to be the video today um i obviously you can tell that i haven't been able to work out today which really sucks because that's how that's that's how i that's how i literally get through a day and I'm not going to be able to work out because I'm going to be busy with work. and So I might try to squeeze a video in later tonight. We'll see. But until then, um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Go check out my older content. If you like those videos, give them a like too. And uh, uh, be well, all of you. Take care. And I'll see you. I'll be there for you in the next video. Goodbye.